Hello everybody and welcome back. Thank you for joining me again. I appreciate that you're spending your time with me. In this video, what I'm about to show you is not the ideal way to connect everything, but this is just more as a proof of concept that this is actually doable. Quite a while ago, I received a question from one of my viewers and he asked me, can he take his Galaxy phone with a DeX uh, feature and connect in some way to get the laptop in my case, it's just a PC monitor, but in, in, in his question, it's a laptop and the laptop screen will show a DeX desktop. Well, this is doable. And like I said, I'm, what I'm about to show you is, is not the ideal way. You might have a different way. You have a better solution. And if you have a better solution or idea how to improve this, leave your suggestions in the comment section below or you can find us on Reddit. Recently, I took over the subreddit category, subreddit group called Samsung Dex. I will leave the link in that group to that group in the description below. Please join us and let's let's discuss uh, about Dex, how to improve, share your experience, share your knowledge and help others to uh, find Dex and, and basically make Dex taking over the world because this is amazing thing. This is amazing thing. So how to get everything working? First of all, I'll quickly show you how everything is connected. My Note 9 is connected to a DeX station third generation. I have a power cable. Power comes from a wall socket. This is the, the USB hub, which I'm using here with a keyboard and a mouse. And behind it, this black cable here, this. This is the HDMI cable, which goes all around this monitor. And this is the end. So at the moment, phone is just connected there to a DeX and it's just at the moment is charging. How to get everything's working, I will use this. This is Elgato HD60 game capture card. And what this card is special, um, it allows you to basically, um, first of all, capture your output, capture your any HDMI input, pass through to a monitor, and then same time capture on your computer. HDMI 60S is powerful and is, it uses the USB Type-C cable and the other end of this cable is USB free. So a data, data uh, pass through through this cable is, is so fast so it's, there is very very low latency or lag. I used the previous game capture cards before when I was recording other things and I noticed there was two, three seconds delay. So I had to delay my webcam, delay my microphone to somehow sync everything in one place. This basically eliminates this headache and it works brilliantly. And what's special about this and might work on another's, I not tried it yet, but this basic tricks the DeX, the Samsung, my Samsung Note 9 phone, and tricks in that way that the phone thinks that I'm actually connected to a HDMI monitor, but actually I connected to a same computer that is basically taking the input from Elgato. So what I'll do first, I'll plug in Elgato to my computer. So computer detect Elgato, lights flashed in the middle. So right now this is connected. I'll take the HDMI output and I'll plug in into Elgato. My phone had a quick toaster message saying HDMI connected. At the moment, uh, I need to do a quick tinkering here. What it means, I need to deactivate and activate Elgato again. And what you see is Dex, Dex, Dex desktop appeared on my computer. So what's happening is I do need a monitor. I can basically connect this to my computer and let's say use Elgato game capture program, which uses a feature called instant replay or instant gameplay. What it means is lag free data pass through. So what that means, I can take that software, put it in a full screen mode and all the monitor will be a DeX desktop. I tried that just before recording this video, but I couldn't record the video and the same time show it to you. So uh, basically I'm showing you in OBS because then I can record the webcam and I can record just a portion of a DeX desktop, but I hope you, you, you understand what I'm trying to say. So if I'll unplug that in, I'll plug the DeX. And by the way, there is no monitor, nothing. So right now that's all is connected. It's just to a computer. If I take the HDMI cable, plug back in and here you go. DeX desktop appeared. Brilliant. 
to be honest, I didn't. I, I, I was thinking that this is a bad idea. I don't think it is going to work, but it did. So, like I said, it's not the ideal way to connect everything. You might have a better way. So leave your suggestions comment section below or inside the subreddit group, which I leave a link to description inside the description as well. Please join us there and share your experience about Dex with others. And I'll see how how to get this a bit smaller factor, maybe somehow get away from a power cable because I know my Note 9 supports USB type C to HDMI adapters. I might get one and somehow try to get all this working and uh, without without like less cables, but it is working and <laughs> I'm surprised. Thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video and I'll see you in the next one. Don't forget to click like, subscribe. Please share this video if you find this useful and share with your friends, family, and neighbors, your co-workers, your worst enemy, everybody who thinks that Dex is amazing to share. Maybe they, they, get, they will get some experience of this. And uh, if you have any suggestions, like I mentioned before, leave them in the comment section below or inside the subreddit group. Thank you and goodbye.